Thanks to everyone who has subscribed. If you have not, please do. And thanks for coming out here. I really appreciate you. Oshomole, APC crisis deepens as two acting national chairmen emerges. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, whatever time we're reaching you today. We want to say thank you very much for your huge, massive and continuous support. We really, truly appreciate you. God bless you. My people, hmm. with the news of uh, Oshomole suspension, uh, APC crisis has deepened. In fact, the party as we speak is divided. There are two chairmen that has emerged, and this is the matter we are, uh, we are about to unfold. So you can know exactly what is going on in APC. This is supposed to be the party ruling Nigeria. But if a, part, a house divided against itself, how can it now coordinate itself, put itself together to be able to give direction to a people, to a nation? These are some of the issues that we are talking about. Anyway, sit back, relax, and get all the details. The Deputy National Secretary of the All Progressive Congress, APC, Chief Victor Gadam, has kicked against the appointment of Abiola Ajimobi as the acting national chairman of the party. The appeal court on Tuesday upheld the suspension of Comrade Adams Oshomole as the national chairman of APC. And now the battle for his temporary replacement seems to have begun after the National Working Committee, NWC, appointed the immediate past governor of Oyo State, Senator Abiola Ajimobi, as the acting national chairman. However, Godom, in a statement by his lawyer, Chief Wale Afolabi, insisted that the office of the acting chairman is his to occupy. He insisted that the order of the Federal High Court Territory, FCT High Court, issued on March 16, 2020, by Honorable Justice S.U. Bachiri in suit number FCT slash HC slash M slash 6447 slash 2020 to the effect that Chief Victor Gadam is the acting, should be the acting national chairman of the party following the suspension of Comrade Adams Oshomole. He said the High Court ordered, however, remained. Ajimobi's appointment non and void and has no effect with the High Court order. This has made it not to be non-effective. The statement added, our attention has been drawn to a statement publicly issued by the Public Secretary of the APC to the effect that Senator Ajimobi Abiola is the acting national chairman of APC following the suspension from Office of Comrade Adams Oshomole by the Court of Appeal. We wish to state that the statements must be issued in compliance and in complete ignorance of the order of the FCT High Court issued on 16th of March 2020 by Honorable Justice S. Ubachiri in the suit number FCT slash HC slash M slash 6447 slash 2020 so the effect that Chief Victor Gadam is to act as the national chairman of the party due to the suspension of Comrade Adams Oshomole as the national chairman. The order was given the same day that the Court of Appeal earlier gave Oshomole a temporary suspension despite him appealing. By staying, at, by staying the executive council, to keep to the order of the suspension of Adam Sushomole. Now that the Court of Appeal has affirmed the order of the suspension, it is only proper that the order recognizes Chief Victor Gadam as its impended acting national chairman. Consequently, we have written to all law enforcement agencies to implement the said order and anyone who attempts to parade him or herself as the chief as anyone who 
intends to parade him or herself as the acting chairman other than Chief Victor as the acting chairman of APC will be facing contempt of court persecution. Daily Post reported that the Court of Appeal sitting in Abuja on Tuesday affirmed the suspension of Comrade Adams Ushomole as the national chairman. The former Edo state governor who also suspended as a matter of the ruling party. The court upholds the earlier ruling of the High Court in Abuja, which on March 4, 2020, suspended Ushomole, asked him to stop parading himself as the national chairman of the party. Justice Eunice, in an anonymous judgment in the first appeal, held that the Fe Federal High Court had jurisdiction to have entertained the suit as it did. The appointee court also upheld the withdrawal of his rights and privileges as the national chairman of the party, including his security details of police and state security service. So now the crisis in APC has actually just started. I'm telling you, the crisis has just started. The crisis has just started. Remember that Adam Soshomole was suspended on the 4th of May, but he didn't take it seriously. You know, you know that, that thing, you know, there is an English adage and proverb that says, waiting you not look to be important when you consider not, not, not get matter or meaning. Now your neighbor take better pass you. So what we are saying is the high court that um, suspended Adam Soshomole, he, he, he appealed and the appeal court yesterday has upholded the high court decision. So as we speak, Adam Soshomole remains suspended. But while all this was going on, Adam Soshomole is not paying attention to his court case. And this is also the issue that is looming APC as we speak. Because APC as a party as we speak is intending to put um, Eze Iyamu, one of his consensus candidates, forward. And they gave him a waiver due to the fact that, uh, you know, it's part of the constitution of APC that they can give waivers depending on the matter and the issue on ground. What happened is, right now as we speak, the court case he did not consider to be important is what is trailing back and coming back to haunt him. So, Adam Soshomole remains suspended, meaning some persons has been acting in the background to go back to the court or to make sure that the appeal courts call back the case and suspends Adams Oshomole. Remember Adams Oshomole, like a matter, like, you know, like something he did not really take seriously, he just took it with the levity or a pinch of salt, is now what has, what has come back and what is coming back to be a nemesis on his part. Because the appeal court right now as we speak has gone ahead and has said what we uphold that decision. Remember that when late Abakiari was alive, he was the person who was, you know, uh, who, who, who uh, we, as we, are, we heard, is alleged, you know, uh, spoke to the court and they reinstated Adams Oshomole without, you know, uh, looking into the matter critically. They, they reinstated him and they said APC should not bring themselves to the court. Meanwhile, uh, the person of Chief Gadam went ahead and said no. We have to make sure that, uh, you know, he, he did it by court. He went to the court and the court gave an order saying Chief Godom should be the person that should represent Adams Oshomole while his suspension was on ground until Adams Oshomole, you know, uh, was, was asked to return. Adams Oshomole has returned now, but they are asking Ajimobi, who APC said, according to their constitution, should be the acting uh, national chairman until Adam Soshomole returns. Guess what? Hmm. Ajimobi is in a critical state. And as we speak, uh, APC is now in serious crisis because Ajimobi and Godom are saying no. You know, there is the discrepancies. Uh, Godom is saying uh, Ajimobi cannot be because I was given a court injunction to be the uh, national leader, why chairman, why Adam Sushumole is suspended. So APC crisis continues, oh my people. I don't have any more to say because a party, a house that is divided against itself, I don't know how it can, you know, lead the country. That's where we are at the moment.
What do you think? Don't forget to leave us a comment, like us, share, subscribe. Click on the notification button so you can get all our latest news. God bless. Bye for now.